Hey guys, I'm Emir Kitsmanovic, I'm your next gen reporter, so let's hear what some of the players have to say. <laughs> Cheeky question, huh? I know you're a pretty big superstar in Japan. And um, I want to know is like, could you like buy like the whole island if you could? <laughs> no, no, not yet. Not uh, yet, but maybe it's a couple it's more years. It's in a plan. Yeah. Okay. So Noah, it can be weird talking to you in English. It feels weird talking to you in English. I agree. You're the world number one. How does it feel, you know, to be the best in like this whole stadium or facility that we're in right now? It's it's a kind of a rock and roll stage for tennis, you know. In a way, it's it's a huge stadium. I can only imagine yeah. how Janko just yeah. won his first Masters event in several years. You've been on the tour longer than I've been alive, almost. So, um, do you have any tips, you know, that I can use out here? Enjoy yourself. It's uh, and you have enough time, you know. I think when you're young, you always think like it has to happen like tomorrow. Just have a have a blast out there because I wish I was still your age and could do it all over again. So I'm a little bit sad. I'm at the back end of my career, but uh, I'm sure they have a great career. Dominic, you know, I know we did off season together, and you know, I know I don't want to take any credit, but you know, I had a big part in this. You know, I was a little disappointed you didn't mention me in your speech because I was disappointed you didn't mention me in the in the press because you broke the top 100. I mean, okay, that's fair enough. You won a few titles, you know, over the years. Um, you think you could, you know, lend me a few of your trophies, you know, possibly the Grand Slam ones? Sure, I got plenty of <laughs> it. Uh, uh, he does? No, so. no, you gotta, you, you, you'll learn, you will learn. I think it will be more useful if I am there to support you and maybe give you uh, advices through my experiences that can maybe help you, guide you to, to a Grand Slam victory. You're dating Christina, you know, for a while now. She's obviously a tennis player too, so, you know, I've noticed you're doing a lot more better, you know, since you started dating her. So, like, what, what's the secret there? Well, first of all, she's a very nice girl. <laughs> That's the first thing. And then, yeah, we understand each other good in every part, so it works out well. What's your favorite anime show? I like uh, Naruto. I like that one too. I actually watched you know? it. Yeah, no I watched way. the whole thing. That's <laughs> an unreal show. <laughs> you travel with your dog. You bring yep. Her, bring her everywhere. So Most places. Has she ever done anything to embarrass you? Uh, no, I don't think she can. I am too uh, head over heels for her. She's. Um, it's one of those things. I think it's like having a kid. Even stuff that maybe other people think might be embarrassing. I just find it probably more cute than anything else. I have one more difficult one. I hope you're ready. Okay. Um, so we all know you have four kids. So I think what we want to know is which one is your favorite? Oh, this is not, not the question you ask. Uh, I love them all equally. They're just um, cute and silly and uh, cheeky and uh, cuddly and the best. So cheeky question, huh? Good one. No, like I asked, like was that like the line or like is he gonna get upset? Oh, no, like, I actually uh, never been asked. So I actually never been asked. <laughs>